what is it that you specifically look for that allows you to determine whether something's fake or real? The first thing I look at is just the, how the card sits. A lot of cards will come that are fake. They'll come with a dot matrix registry, so it'll look little tiny micro dots all over the place. Like from like a printer or something? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. And then uh, the card stock is always off because you can't replicate paper stock from the 50s sure. or you know even the modern stuff today. And also sometimes you'll see where the card actually looks like it's been aged, purposely aged, where people will drop coffee grounds on it, throw it in the oven, try to tone it so it looks kind of age appropriate from that time period. And so from your rich history in the space, being one of the original graders at PSA or the original grader, is it just one of those things that's just a, it's, it's like memory? Simple answer is yes. The overall answer though is that there's so many great resources online right now where guys have really gone out of their way to be an expert within that particular TCG Pokemon, you know, and really taking it to another level. So even I'll get on there and make sure that I'm staying above the curve and listening to what the, the newest fakes may be out there or whatever. Just kind of keep your finger on the pulse of what's going on. Makes sense.